Welcome to the Washington, D.C. Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence and MRIS Company. Let's examine the most recent numbers for housing market activity in the nation's capital. In October, the U.S. economy continued its steady progress, adding 171,000 jobs. While the unemployment rate edged up slightly to 7.9 percent, initial claims for unemployment insurance were more consistent with long-term trends. Over the past 12 months, the U.S. economy has added 1.9 million new jobs, fueled by growth in the private sector. The biggest challenge facing the economy in the near term is the debate over the fiscal cliff, a set of tax hikes and federal spending cuts. It's likely Congress and the President will come to some agreement that will avoid the cliff. However, the issues that drove us toward the cliff probably will not be resolved, but rather will be deferred. The failure to resolve the structural fiscal issues in the economy suggests there will be continued uncertainty in early 2013, which will continue to be a drag on recovery. Nationwide, sales of new and existing homes continue to improve and new residential starts are up. The positive signs in the housing market, along with improving consumer confidence, point to steady, though still modest, improvement in the U.S. economy. Despite losses in federal government employment, the D.C. economy still posted healthy job growth, adding more than 22,000 resident workers over the past 12 months. The unemployment rate in the district remains unchanged from last month at 8.8%. Housing market activity in the nation's capital continues to improve relative to last year. There were 527 sales in October, 25% higher than October 2011, and the highest year-over-year -year gain in two and a half years. New pending contracts also performed well, climbing 14% from this time last year. The inventory of homes for sale continues to decline. There were 1,416 active listings at the end of October, 36% below this time last year, a drop of over 800 listings. The 772 new listings entered in October were down 4% from last year and are the lowest October level the district has seen in over a decade. At $445,000, the median sales price is up 11% from October 2011. This is the highest October median price on record for the district. Homes continued to sell faster with the median days on market falling 23 days from last year to the current level of 14 days. The shrinking supply of active listings in Washington, D.C. will likely keep prices stable even as market activity slows with seasonality. Buyers are still active in the market as evidenced by the growth in new contracts. However, the inventory of new listings has not shown any signs of adjusting to this demand. That's the Washington, D.C. Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest.